that I'm using today is by Essence, is this palette. I saw it a few days ago in the drugstore, so I felt like, oh my god, let me just use it for one of my five minute tutorials. It has a lot of like soft colors and some really beautiful shimmery colors in it as well, so I wanted to use it for today. And I started with the light brownish color. I'm gonna start using that all over in the crease, going from the inner corner to the outer corner, just to warm up the whole crease. And I take a really big fluffy blending brush. The one I used is the E40. And now I'm taking my finger to apply this really soft pink color. You can also use a brush, but I've said this a few times before in my videos, like I feel like using your finger with a shimmery color just gives more color payoff on the eyelids. So definitely use your finger if you have problems like not getting like a lot of color payoff with your eyeshadows. So then I went in with the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner and I took a angled brow brush from Sigma Beauty. This is actually my favorite brush to apply gel eyeliner. I started with creating like a simple line above the lash line. Um, this is always what I do before I create a winged liner. I'm really focused to like get a straight line as possible above the lash line. And then when everything is looking good, then I focus on the winged liner. Now you can use the eyeshadow guard as a guideline for your winged liner. Um, this is gonna leave you with a sharp edge as you can see right now. You can leave the eyeshadow guard on or you can remove it like I did. You will st still see like a line of where um, the eyeshadow guard is. Um, this is totally up to you. If you don't have any eyeshadow guard, you can also use some normal sticky tape. This will do the job as well. And then I went in with the darkest brown color which comes in the palette by Essence. I'm gonna take a really tiny brush from Suif and I'm gonna smudge this eyeshadow right above where I just applied the gel eyeliner. So I'm really like smudging it on top of the gel eyeliner and a little bit above it. And then I went in with this concealer from Barry M Cosmetics and I'm gonna use it right underneath the wing liner to clean it up and to make the line a little bit more sharp with no eyeshadow underneath. Then I'm taking this pencil from L'Oreal. Um, this is actually such a beautiful color. It kind of reminds me of a pencil that I used to use from Urban Decay, which is called Lucky. But this one is obviously a lot more affordable and I really love the copper brown shade. Um, when it comes to eye pens for the one line, like those kind of shades are my favorite to use. And I love that it's drugstore. Then now I quickly curled my lashes and for my mascara. I'm gonna use this one by Rimmel London. It's called the Wonder Lux Volume Mascara. It's actually really nice. It definitely gives a lot of volume. But I didn't want it to apply too much on my upper lashes because I am going in with fake lashes. And sometimes when I apply too much mascara, my lashes get in the way and it's kind of harder to apply the fake lashes but for the lower lashes I really liked it and make my lashes really long and super black so so far I really like the mascara and for my fake lashes I'm gonna use lashes